Party Shoes, by Noel Streetfield, is a charming exploration of childhood aspirations, the power of imagination, and the societal values that permeated post-war England. The novel, set in the aftermath of World War II, captures the innocence of youth against the backdrop of a world slowly recovering from the devastation of conflict. It is a story that reflects not only the personal dreams of its young characters but also the larger societal changes and challenges of the time. The narrative revolves around Selina, a young girl who receives a gift from her godmother, a pair of beautiful party shoes. These shoes, however, become a symbol of a lost world, one where parties, dances, and social gatherings were commonplace, but now seem like a distant memory in the war-torn reality of post-war Britain. The gift sparks a longing in Selina to wear the shoes at a grand event, a longing that sets the entire plot in motion. Streetfield's depiction of Selina's desire to use the shoes highlights the contrast between the pre-war and post-war eras. The shoes are not just a piece of fashion, they represent a connection to a past that was more carefree and socially vibrant. Selena's longing to wear them at a party is a poignant reflection of the collective yearning for normalcy and celebration in a time when such luxuries were rare. The shoes, therefore, become a metaphor for hope, dreams, and the desire for a return to better times. The children's plan to stage a play in order to create an occasion for Selena to wear the shoes underscores their creativity and resilience. In a world where adults are preoccupied with rebuilding and recovering, the children take matters into their own hands, showing an impressive degree of agency. The play, which they produce with great effort and enthusiasm, becomes a microcosm of the larger world, they create a society within the play that reflects their own desires, conflicts, and aspirations. Streetfield's writing delves into the psychology of her young characters with sensitivity and depth. Each child in the story is given a distinct personality, and their interactions reveal much about the social dynamics of the time. The emphasis on cooperation, creativity, and the importance of community reflects the values that were crucial in the post-war recovery period. The children's play is not just a personal project, it is a communal effort that brings together different personalities and talents, mirroring the larger societal need for unity and collaboration. The novel also subtly addresses issues of class and social change. The world the children create in their play is an idealized version of society, one where everyone has a role to play and where social hierarchies are less rigid. This reflects the changing social landscape of post-war Britain, where traditional class structures were beginning to be questioned and where there was a growing emphasis on equality and meritocracy. The resolution of the story, where the play is successfully staged and Selina finally gets to wear her shoes, is both triumphant and bittersweet. While the children achieve their goal, there is an underlying recognition that the world has changed irrevocably. The play and the shoes serve as a temporary escape from reality, a brief return to a world that no longer exists. However, in achieving their goal, the children also learn important lessons about the realities of life, the importance of perseverance, and the power of imagination. Party Shoes is a novel that, while centered on the seemingly simple desire of a young girl to wear a pair of shoes, offers a profound commentary on the post-war experience. Through the eyes of children, Streetfield explores themes of loss, hope, and the enduring power of dreams. The novel is a testament to the resilience of the human spirit and the ability of the young to find joy and purpose even in the most challenging of times. It is a story that resonates not just as a piece of children's literature, but as a reflection of the broader human experience in a world recovering from the ravages of war.